How's it going guys? Merch here bringing you another Honkai Star Rail video and today we're gonna watch the live stream recap by MTash. <laughs> I was asleep when this happened so let's just watch MTash's recap. We've got a new planet coming and some of the craziest news we've ever seen for Honkai Star Rail or Genshin Impact combined. We've got some free Stellar Jade, we've got some juicy new events, but more importantly, a free 5 star unit. I can't believe what? I'm saying this with my lips, but everyone who plays the game and unlocks the mail system between 1.6 and 2.2 gets a free Dr. Ratio. <laughs> You get a free five-star banner character, no questions asked. All you have to do is play the game. This is insanity. Now, if I'm being honest, I was probably going to skip Dr. Ratio because even though he looks really cool, he works with debuffing units, he has follow-up attacks, overall Genshin pretty could cool never. being a hunt imaginary character, what I just didn't really have a stellar hell? jade. Now, I don't have to worry about it. Getting this on my main account, pretty awesome. Getting them on my secondary what account that I've been fuck? playing around with for free is absolutely nuts. And any person okay, getting that's free, the end of the video. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's crazy. This opens what up a lot of doors fuck? to your elements in the game. It, it kind of just pulls that's back all I your need to know. <laughs> the five star. What the fuck, man? Just pick up whoever you want because I guarantee a Dr. Ratio to your fucking is going to make it easier for everyone. And I don't know, like, this is crazy. It's a new tool. It's a new Imaginary I am very excited for this. And I cannot believe this is really good, man. Never five star. And not even, we're, we're not even talking about a standard character So fucking character good. Here. This is a limited character. Very, very cool. I am blown away. Oh, my but friend's going to be really uh, happy. <laughs> but also, with the new event coming, he still uh, hasn't gotten a DPS. Be an God -tier unit. But in all content of the game, and now we're getting a free five star. Comp. She allows you to break units easier, put them back down while even the anniversary. She, and res, she is a very sad Because we're getting Dr. Ratio for free. Now we can go all in on really Ruan May. So if you do want to go for her, <laughs> you've got a lot of time before another Damn. leader comes out. Now, she's also sharing a banner with Blade, which I'll show you in a minute. Ugh. So if you really wanted Blade, maybe you could use your Dr. Ratio pulse on, on him or something like that. But um, oh I'm going to be going for God. her because she looks really cool. And she looks like she opens up a door. I really like characters in this game. That and I'm guessing we still have the, she is, the first units that gift of Odyssey. Kind of OP. She adds a lot of value to your the team. free like, temple. Units, and, and I just love the fact that she has all pan <laughs> guy star is insane, man. She's going to work with pretty much every team comp out there. And uh, I'm very excited to have this unit on my team. There's not much more to say than that. As for this little mama... She's a four star. Uh, she's four star DPS. She's quantum. She's cool. And We're I mean, getting shui. Right? <laughs> no matter what. Five star DPS with enough. I, I am getting shui. Right man. You, especially because we're getting a free, you know, five star hunt character. Um, you know, she's cool. She's awesome. But um, I think that a lot of us are gonna have enough really great five star DPS units. It's hard to get too too excited. As for the banners, let's have a chat. Um, this one pretty good. We've got the new character on it, which is okay, always nice. nice. Ting Yun, okay. Ting Yun is literally one of the best units uh, in the game. If you can I have Ting Yun E6. If you did want Blade, maybe you want to pull on both banners. You've got more opportunities to get more Ting Yun, which makes your. So I guess I'm just gonna and, get uh, and getting max Shui. Is amazing. As for Dr. Ratio's banner, well. I get to skip this one because Natasha it's power trash. Cut, not great hook <laughs> fine in the early game, but let's be honest, not great. Kafka enjoyers, I'm so sorry. Oh, this banner that's doesn't sad. Look amazing for you. I, I apologize. It's just not great. That's no sad for Kafka uh, pullers, the light cones, man. The light cones characters. <laughs> Her banner's trash. If you want a light cone? You can consider it, but there are really good four star options. Uh, Secret Vow on Blade. You know, some awesome four star uh, pieces. I don't want to ever push people into these things uh, because I think they're unnecessary in a lot of cases. Yeah, fuck the light wow. cone. The banners. Um, for fuck me, the light I'm pretty excited cone, about it. Anytime for real. That I want to pull on that's a W because I don't have her at E6 yet. I've got like E4 uh, on my account, I think. And I, I, I only just, pulled I that E6. Jingle is light cool, code because um, I really like don't her. Don't go crazy on these banners because sometimes you can put 300 pulls in and get like one copy of a, of a four star or just never get a copy. So just be careful. Let's talk about the new event. The new event looks, well, I, I say new event. There's like six of them. This is one of the new bosses that's going to be available. And uh, this one, okay. it does have some value when you get back. I am another break good break looking so boss. Really cool because as this boss mutates, if you break the boss as it's But it's mutating, like a reskin of the swarm. Or it's going to be the most vulnerable in that moment. And so, but it still looks really, really good cool. in the new game mode or the new boss. You know, we, we tend to see this happen. Uh, looks really cool overall. It's kind of Swarm Disaster looking boss. Um, not much more to say about this, but let me show you the new event. We get a lot of cute pets and we get to be a little doggy. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Hold on. There's another one. This one allows you to get these, these permanent unlocks, these different dice okay. to spice up the gameplay. All of them are really crazy. Um, it's literally just a new version of Swarm Disaster with a different mechanic. Um, there's the Eridition path now as well. So if you Damn. Characters, they're going to get a buff in this content or give you some more They're going content. all in on the Swarm, really cool. on the path, but then you can simulated the universe. The with these different and dice. that's and like stuff that gives you really more good rewards, more, more in my opinion. Cosmic fragments, uh, better energy, and it's just a whole new thing. You dive the in, simulated you universe in. is really I mean, fun. This is just good content. They're taking yep. something that works and reusing it and redoing it and making something new. This is going to play out differently than what we've seen in the past, or, or it's going to yep. have a, a bit of a different feel. Definitely, it's familiar. Definitely, it's it's like reused content. But there's no problem with that when it's roguelike content. Yeah. This is just good stuff. If it ain't I'm broke, don't fucking fix it. it. I cannot wait to play it. They've also got some That's the number one rule. Kind of branching past, and you can link it all together. 
I'm impressed. I'm really impressed. But there's actually more like combat events around here. We've got some different bosses and there's things like more? that. But there's more. There's more. Okay. We've got some planner fissure. We've got the other one. But here's the big one. This is the big one. Let me show you this. Okay. This is the new game mode. You kill the enemies. They respawn in. There's multiple paths here. 720 uh, Stellar Jade each time you complete it. This event looks awesome. There's going to be different buffs and debuffs, kind of, or, or, or you know, like a kind of floor bonuses, whatever you want to call it. Um, each run, uh, there's going to be different enemies, and you want to just kill them as much as you can. There's going to be some different mechanics here, but here is the thing. With Pure Fiction, anyone who plays it and beats the second floor will get, I'll skip ahead here, a free Lynx. There it is. A free Lynx. Now, this oh, is going to be uh, potentially E5, potentially E6 on mine. Very excited. Lynx is Mine's E2. She power creeps Natasha. She's going to be E3 then. I think is worse nice. than one copy of Lynx. Lynx is an absolute powerhouse as a four-star unit. She is so good uh, sustain-wise and cleansing-wise. Everyone getting a copy of Lynx is W. If you're getting E1, E2, E4, E6, she just gets even more value. Like, she's, she's actually crazy. Um, and so this is very exciting to me. I cannot wait to get her. Um, the new event stuff looks really good. They also talked about the Memory of Chaos. We're getting some extra floors, which is another 120 <laughs> stellar There we go, month, the 11 and 12. you can auto-clear some of the content. So you're only going to have to do five floors uh, instead. And you can Man, see here, with I can't Chaos, even do the 9 and 10 anymore. Rota uh, not rotating, I but can't be, even restart um, the 9 and 10 each anymore. Each week, one of them resets. So you clear it, you wait two weeks, you clear the other one, and you can do both of these. Because they week. change it too. There's a, there's a bit of a little, a little gap while the other ones are 20 resetting. remaining cycles. It's too hard. You're going to be able to save up so many wishes, right? Like, this is absolutely crazy. Um, I'm very excited for this. And then they added some quality life features. So it's going to remember the teams you're using. And then you can just press this little button up here and just swap them. So, uh, you know, if you're endgame so like far myself, good. I have two teams that can clear all the content. I can do like a mono quantum team and then another one for the most part and clear all content. So you just press the button, swap them over, and you're done. So that is pretty cool overall. Very excited about that. So um, fucking good. There's man. not too much more on that event. Like, um... They are doing some quality of life stuff where you can unlock um, some of the activities early. Uh, I think that's just so you don't have to go to a new planet. This is always juice, though. We got a free 10 pull every go. single patch. Can't believe that. That's very exciting. Uh, but yeah, then they just pulled this on us. They're like, oh, by the way, we won this award. Let's give everyone a free Dr. Ratio. I, I just can't believe it. I still <laughs> cannot believe that they're doing this. Um, Damn. So much, hype, so much news going on right now uh, in the game. And, uh, and then this was really cool as well. Let me just kind of fast forward through this. They showed off. Uh, a bunch of the character stories, or, or sorry, story characters, and some most likely playable characters that are coming with Pentacony. So um, I, I'm getting some like Vegas vibes or Golden Saucer from Final Fantasy. Uh, I'm very excited. They just did like a, a kind of a, a little talk about Pentacony. They showed off Robin. They showed off a bunch of these units. They look pretty glamorous. I'm very excited for some of this. They also showed some like IPC uh, people. Um, I don't know. I I'm so excited to go to a new planet, do a new story. I've enjoyed the story so far, same, in the game, but I feel same, like we've been in the Xianjo for so long. It's gonna be nice to go somewhere new. Play new Sam, and, and that's holy the thing is, shit. there's story, there's some chests and exploration, <laughs> but there's new end game content, multiple pieces of end game content that you need to build some teams. Think about it. I don't know. I'm gonna be honest with you here. The Honkai Star Rail devs are killing it. They are they are making such a good. They're game. so far in, insane, man. Honestly. For me, at least, I'm so surprised that HSR isn't more popular. Now, I, I know it won like best mobile game at the the, the game awards and stuff, but because it's stern based, a free game that is better than some paid games. Stern based. And I understand. Okay, well, you, you know, you can't get all the characters, and and you have to, you know, you have to be patient, and there's some FOMO, and you got to play the events, and I, I understand that, but it's free. That's why it's not giving more a free popular. Unit, and I don't know. Because I, it's they're giving enough that I'm most characters in the game without spending any money. It's cracked. And it's just getting better. So that's pretty much all I want to say. Honkai Star Rail is nailing it. And uh, I can't wait no to see way. the few. Pretty cool. <laughs> so I guess we're getting a free 5 star on the 1.6 patch, guys. It's not even the anniversary. <laughs> HSR devs are fucking insane. So if you enjoyed this video, if you have any suggestions, write it down in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe. As always, good luck on your summons for Ruan Me. Thank you all for watching. See you on the next one. Peace.